does not need to be well versed in construction and engineering to realize the magnitude of this endeavor. That will be an incredible feat when it happens and would significantly help in decongesting Metro Manila as motorists will be able to travel without passing through the metropolis. It will also help in bringing prices down for goods and services as the transport and logistics cost will, it will decrease, thereby generating immense savings all around. And uh, facing the challenges, it, is, it was prescient that, uh, we, that we continued with this project until we got to this point, and I am sure until it is finished. It is prescient because we did, at that time we did not think of uh, supply chain problems that uh, now that we have. And this, is, this kind of improved connectivity is the perfect solution to that. So new, nuclear, new, new opportunities will likewise be open to Bataan and Cavite and their surrounding provinces because of the easier access that will be made available. It is also impressive to think about how this project will support the development of seaports in the said provinces, making them potential international shipping gateways for the country. This will be a very important milestone in the infrastructure development of the country under the administration of President Bongbong Marcos at this time because this will interconnect the north and south sectors uh, which are actually yung mga economic drivers uh, natin. So uh, with this bridge, uh, certainly it will give uh, direct benefits to uh, the, this, uh, the northern part and southern part corridors for further development. No? There will be a lot of uh, economic activities that will come out of it. Uh, we have been talking with the president about it and I think uh, certainly from tourism to uh, other uh, facilities that can be transferred in Bataan and Cavite. The target namin dito is uh, we are trying to uh, implement it through several contract packages. No? Siguro mga pito na contract packages ito so that uh, we can simultaneously implement. And hopefully we will try our best actually na matapos within five years during the term of the President.